Is there anything a woman can do to improve the quality of her of her eggs? So insulin resistance is probably one of the biggest things that I look at when someone comes to me and says, you know what, I'm dealing with these problems, whether I'm trying on my own or often it's like an unexpected outcome. Someone who is young enough that I thought it would be reasonable to get a certain number of embryos from that certain number of eggs sure. that were retrieved. And there was a lot of drop off and attrition in a way that makes you think, okay, there might be an egg quality issue here. Mm -hmm. Now, for sure, there could be a sperm component as well, but sometimes you can actually isolate out for that. When you're going through treatment, there are things you can do to try to improve the sperm that you're using. You can sort them differently. And still you might see this attrition and they have these telltale risk factors for mm -hmm. insulin resistance, which is actually quite common and prevalent. So many women have some element of insulin resistance if they're struggling with their weight, especially women with PCOS. They're kind of just predisposed or a setup mm -hmm. for, for being a little bit resistant to insulin, which is a hormone that helps you to store your blood sugar in your cells. And what that does, if you tend to have resistance to that hormone, is you end up producing more insulin. And insulin actually acts like a growth factor on the ovaries, and it right. can make your ovaries overproduce testosterone. And having that unhealthy imbalance, and now that's the environment where the eggs are undergoing all that genetic reorganization, it can make them more prone to errors. So anything that is an external influence that can make those errors more likely is something that you could modify to try to improve egg quality.